Ryan Blaney, the newly crowned NASCAR Cup Series champion, is quite the racing prodigy. But as it turns out, there's more to him than meets the eye. In this video, we're unveiling 10 little-known facts about Blaney's life that are sure to surprise you. From his epic love affair with Star Wars, featuring a Darth Vader tattoo that steals the show, to his quirky fear of ghosts and his famous girlfriends, this video is your backstage pass into the world of the NASCAR sensation. Here are 10 things you probably didn't know about Ryan and I've got to say number two is my favorite. Number 10, huge Star Wars fan. Ryan Blaney is undoubtedly the biggest Star Wars fan, and he does not try to hide it. Seriously, have you seen the huge tattoo of Darth Vader on his right thigh? He's even gone viral once for dressing as Princess Leia at a Halloween party. Man, you've got to have some balls wearing this on a chilly night in October. We've got to say it's a good thing Princess Leia died, or she'd have some serious competition with Blaney looking like that. In an interview with The Athletic, he shared how his love for Star Wars started at age 6 or 7, when he first watched Episode 1 in 1999. Although his family wasn't into Star Wars, his uncle, a big fan, sparked Blaney's interest. Today, the motor coach he lives in on race weekends at the racetrack is decked out with custom Star Wars decor. He shared that his Star Wars journey began with the excitement of watching Phantom Menace as a kid. That movie became the starting point for his lifelong passion. His favorite movie is still Phantom Menace, even though some people tease him for it. Number 9. Blaney Comes From A Racing Family Ryan Blaney's racing DNA is no accident. It's a family affair. Growing up in the Blaney clan means being surrounded by the pulse-pounding world of racing. His dad, Dave Blaney, is a respected force in NASCAR and beyond. And let's not forget the patriarch, Lou Blaney, Ryan's grandfather, a name that was synonymous with dirt track racing royalty. Lou was a highly respected figure in the dirt track community, and as you can tell, he's passed on the secrets of the track like a well-guarded family recipe. His legacy is woven into the fairy fabric of the Blaney family family, adding another layer to Ryan's racing DNA. From winning his first race at the age of 10 to standing tall as a NASCAR champion, it's safe to say that Ryan Blaney's racing story has come full circle. Number 8. Go-Kart Racing and Car Collection Before he became a big shot in the professional racing scene, Blaney's journey started in the world of go-karts. Yep, those tiny, speedy things. It's where he first showed off his natural talent, zipping around like the pro he is before hitting the big leagues. Once he did transition to the big leagues, his aggressive racing style became his trademark. Fearless and daring, Blaney is known for his bold overtakes and an on-track presence that keeps fans on the edge of their seats. Another thing about him is that he doesn't just crave speed on the racetrack. He's got a thing for fast rides off it, too. Oh, yeah. He's got a jet black Mustang Shelby GT350. And along Alongside, you can see three other Ford vehicles parked up, the 88 F-150, the 88 Ford Bronco, and an F-250. Someone's hooked on Fords. Number 7. Pre-Race Rituals Now this one might catch you a little off guard, but we promise you it's got nothing to do with OCD. When Blaney was asked if he's got any pre-race rituals, he revealed something rather strange. Well, he had two things to say. The first being that he makes sure he's had a good lunch or dinner before the race, and the second one's where it gets a little weird. He mentioned that he always Always, without exception, puts his left glove on first, and then the right glove goes on. Kind of funny, but it's really not that weird, because it's just become a habit that he can't escape at this point. Number 6. Loves to play the guitar this guy may look mean in his number 12 Ford Mustang, but you'll be surprised to know that he also loves music. He loves to play the guitar, and let us tell you, he's pretty darn good at it. Ever the laid-back personality, Blaney occasionally treats his fans to his musical talents. You might stumble upon videos of him jamming on social media. Now, if you catch him off the track, you'll be greeted by a laid-back and friendly Blaney. His approachable and down-to-earth nature has made him a fan favorite in the racing community. Honestly, he's the kind of guy you'd want to grab a burger with, chat about racing, and maybe be even joined for an impromptu jam session. Number 5. Blaney's teammate Brad Keselowski was his landlord. As it turns out in the world of NASCAR, teammates can also be landlords. Ryan Blaney had a unique living situation as his teammate Brad Keselowski served as his landlord. This unconventional arrangement added an interesting dynamic to their relationship beyond the racetrack. Number 4. Most Tattoos on the Grid Did you know that Ryan is possibly the most inked driver on the track? He's up against the likes of Chase Elliott and Carson Weir, but with at least five visitors, visible tattoos, he's taken the first spot. His chest bears a sprint car, most probably the same one that his grandfather drove, so it's an homage to Lou Blaney. There's also a number 10 etched on his chest, which is a tribute to his father Dave Blaney and the family's racing roots. And how could we forget the infamous Darth Vader tattoo on his thigh? Add in a knee tattoo and barbed wire on his ankle, and you've got a mosaic of his racing journey. 
Number 3. Afraid of Ghosts In a recent episode of the Glass Case of Emotion podcast, Ryan pulled back the curtain on a quirky fear. Ghost. Yep, he claims he's all stocked up to fight off a burglar, but a ghost? Heck no. Here's what he said. I'm not really more scared of someone like a burglar or an intruder, more just a weird paranormal. He's especially scared of ghosts because, well, how do you fight one off? You can't shoot a ghost, but as long as it's not a ghost, let us tell you something. If you're a burglar, you should know that Blaney's house is the wrong place to rob. He's got some seriously offbeat home security. The guy keeps every gun he owns under his bed or in his nightstand, and he's pretty sure he can reach one before you do. That's not all, though. He's even hinted at having a spear on standby, just in case anyone decides to break in. And, oh, there's a sword in the mix, too. And apparently it looks like it's from the 1700s, even though it's not. He's got a lightsaber as well, though it didn't make the official list. Number 2. Blaney had a cameo in the Logan Lucky movie and voiced a character in Cars 3. One thing you're probably aware of by now is that Blaney isn't a one-trick pony. He's proven that his talents extend beyond the racetrack, and we've got just a couple more examples of that for you. In the 2017 heist comedy film Logan Lucky, directed by Steven Soderbergh, Ryan made a memorable cameo appearance. The movie, which features an ensemble cast including Channing Tatum and Daniel Craig, follows a group of friends planning a heist during a NASCAR race. Blaney's cameo added a touch of authenticity to the film, bringing a real NASCAR presence to the big screen. In addition to his live-action cameo, Blaney ventured into the animated realm with Cars 3, a film from the beloved Pixar franchise. In this installment, he voiced the character Ryan inside Laney, a clever play on his own name. Voicing a character in an animated film allowed Blaney to connect with a younger audience and showcase his personality in a different creative setting. And number one, partners. Blaney hit the jackpot when he started dating his current girlfriend, Gianna Tulio, who's a rising model from South Florida. Born on July 31st, 1998, the 24-year-old Tulio has seen her celebrity status soar on social media, aligning her career with a relationship with the 2013 NASCAR Camping Series Rookie of the Year. Tulio's modeling prowess extends to both domestic and international levels, particularly as a versatile face for the Hooters brand. From swimwear to formal fashion, she captivates the camera with her blue steel gaze, earning her accolades like being selected as Miss June in the 2019 Hooters calendar and later crowned Miss Hooters in 2021, where she also clinched the most photogenic award during the Orlando-based pageant. Although the exact beginning of Blaney and Tulio's relationship remains a mystery, they made their romance official during a week-long trip to Vail, Colorado, as shared on Instagram. Tulio pursued her education at Palm Beach State College, graduating with an associate's degree in business administration and playing soccer during her freshman year. Tulio is a constant presence on the NASCAR circuit, sharing her support for Blaney as he vies for the Cup Series title with Team Penske. Their lives together also became a part of the USA Network's 2022 series, Race for the Championship, offering viewers a glimpse into their world. Notably, Tulio plays a role in managing Blaney's charitable organization, the Ryan Blaney Family Foundation, and engages in philanthropic activities supporting causes like the Miami Cancer Research Center and the Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital. Together, they form a dynamic couple, showing no signs of slowing down. So what are your thoughts on Ryan Blaney? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to watch the next one that'll pop up on your screen and subscribe to the channel for all things NASCAR.